In this video I want to answer the question how does hypnotherapy work? And people have a lot of misconceptions about hypnotherapy. A lot of people think it's something that's done to them and it's like sleep and they won't know what's going on and they'll wake up acting like a chicken. Um, that's not the case um, when clients come to see me anyway. Uh, hypnosis is not something that I do to clients, it's something that I do in conjunction with them. So I tell clients that, you know, as long as they just follow along to the sound of my voice and follow my instructions, they'll have no problem going into trance. And hypnosis, um, my clients tell me they experience a deeply relaxed state, a state of deep, deep relaxation, uh, but they're aware of everything that's going on around them. And uh, yeah, they're not asleep and they don't wake up acting like chickens. Hypnotherapy works because it's accessing the theta brainwave state and we all experience five different brainwave states during the course of the day. There's the gamma brainwave state, there's the beta brainwave state. Gamma and beta are both what we experience in our normal waking hours. And after beta there's the alpha brainwave state. And the alpha brainwave state, when you go into the alpha brainwave state, it's like it's kind of like the sort of state you'd be experiencing when you are in a slight daydream. And then after alpha comes theta. And theta is the brainwave state that you tend to enter just before sleep. So it's the REM state. Um, it's the state in which dreams occur. And then you've got the delta brainwave state, which is the brainwave state that you go into when you're experiencing deep sleep and in the delta brainwave state that's when your cells are you know rejuvenating and your body's releasing hormones and stuff and it's been found that children up until the age of seven are in the theta brainwave state this brainwave state is known as the imprint period up until the age of seven it's known as the imprint period and this is when children do all their learning. So, you know, children learn to walk, they learn to go to the toilet by themselves, they learn to read, they learn to write. All before the age of seven, they learn to eat. This is when they're, they're taking on the most amount of information. So theta is a hyper-learning state, a state of um, extreme perception, extreme awareness, and it's the state in which positive change can occur. So uh, I hope you like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Click the subscribe button. Click the bell button next to the, next to the subscribe button. And let me know what you think in the comments. Thank you.